All right, Avery Johnson, it is not Trey Jones. The pick is in. You see the Lakers logo there. Then it went to the Thunder. Now it is the Timberwolves selecting Jaden McDaniels overall at 28 out of Washington, 6'10", 200 pounds. Let's turn it over to Gary Parrish to see what he thinks about this. I'd go a C minus here. I actually have Jaden McDaniels in my mock draft going 28. So it makes sense from that perspective. But based on the way this draft has unfolded, uh, there are several guys I have graded ahead of him that I would take here uh, instead of him. He is a terrific prospect, not a very good player. Great prospect, not a player. Uh, coming out of high school, he looks the part. You know, 6'9", 6'10", can bounce it a little bit, play on the perimeter. But at Washington, he was just not any good. Um, he was probably the most disappoint disappointing part of the mis most disappointing team in the Pac-12. Um, led the league in fouls, got benched halfway through the season, butted heads with the coaching staff. But I understand, you know, you try to look at these prospects and imagine what they could be if they become the best versions of themselves. And when you do that with Jaden McDaniels, you can get excited, but you are going to be asking him to be something in the NBA that he was not able to be in college. And that is a productive uh, uh, player that impacts winning in a positive way. Kerry, we'll see if we can turn it around. You mentioned the fouls there. Six technical fouls, the most in D1, fouled out eight times, the most in the pack. Well, hey, silver lining, you get six fouls in the NBA before you get disqualified, right? Jaden McDaniels uh, going to the Minnesota Timberwolves via the other Easy Lakers awesome. and via probably some other team as well. Um, Oklahoma City. We're trying to keep it all straight for you. I do know this. We have two picks left in the first round. The Toronto Raptors are now on the clock and then the Boston Celtics. Oh my gosh, they get at to number pick 30. Again. Yes, that would be their third if they if they do indeed pick there and don't trade it. That would be their third pick of the first round. We're going to finish up the first round when you come back. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.